So the baby come out to show how powerful the greatness of God. Your purpose is about to come out to you. It can't stay in you no more. It has to show itself in particles and creations. You will build plazas that you have never dreamed of building. You will build houses, living houses that you have never dreamed of living. You will build avenues, buy SUVs, live a lovely life that you have never dreamed of living. For the greatness of God will come out of you one day. You have so much in you, so much greatness, so much power, so much glory in you, but something is covering your power. Something is stopping your flow. Something is manipulating your growth. But as soon as the power of God release a mighty wave of glory upon you, that little baby will start push out. Will start push out, isn't it? Most of you today just need one connection. A man married to a woman for eight years and never have a child of greatness until she divorced and married the next one. The right connection come along. Is not every connection agree with you? Is not every contact agree with you? Is not every friends will be like you? Some friends will not like you, but they want to be like you. To a capacity, plug out your wire and try your next connection. Life don't grow with long suffering. Don't prosper that way. But when life flow in the power of the divine, the beauty of life will come out mightily. Get out of your long suffering atmosphere. Get out of your torment atmosphere. For the power of God flow easy like Sunday morning. Life is great. Life is precious. Life is wonderful. Live life and expect the greatness of life. Some people say sometimes coffee and sometimes tea. But today I tell you, it's always coffee for you. I want to open the Bible and I want you to read from Genesis, Genesis 1. Let us just read the beginning of creation. Oh, Father, we thank you. We'll be here because we have events and the property. So we have to be prepared to have all manners in right here. You're with me? Genesis 1. In the beginning, in the beginning, God created the heaven. God created the heaven and the earth. And the earth. And the earth was without form. And the earth was without form. And void. Void. And darkness was and upon. And heavy darkness was upon the face was upon the face of the deep. And the spirit of God and the power of the Lord moved upon. Moved Upon the face of the waters. Yes. And God said. And God said. Let there be light. Let there be light. And there was light. And there was light. Stop right there. So God said, Let there be light. And the first day, and there was light. Continue. And God saw the light. And God saw the light. That it was good. That it was powerful. It was good. And God divided the light. And God divided the light from the darkness. From the darkness. And God called the 
light and day. God called the light day because the light is the sun that shines through the day. Yes. And the darkness he called and the night. Darkness he called night. He gave the moon to control the night. Yes. And the evening and the and morning. The evening and the morning were the first day. Were the first day. So God don't make the sun yet, and God don't make the moon yet. Do you understand me? So how a light appear on the earth? Is that the right to have some cocoa head somewhere? Because the sun and the moon don't make it. And we don't even read a scripture that the sun and the moon created as it. But this is telling us in the first day that God said, let there be light. He divide the light from the darkness. The light he called day because the sun controlled the light in the day and the and the night the darkness he called night because the moon controlled the light of the night. But the sun have not created as yet. But God saw it and he said it was good. We want to hear what happened along the line. Read verse 5. And God called the light day. Yes. And the darkness he called night. Continue. And the evening and the morning were the first day. My God. And God said, Yes. Let there be a firmament, firmament in the midst of the waters. Yes. And let it divide the waters from the waters. And God made the firmament and divided the waters which were under the firmament yes. from the waters which were above the firmament. And it was so. Yes. And God called the firmament heaven. Yes. And the evening and the morning were the second day. Read over. Read over. And God called the light day. Yes. And the darkness he called night. Continue. And the evening. And the, and the evening and the morning were the first day. Were the first day. And God said, and God said, let there be a firmament. Let there be a firmament. So divide water into dust and make dust cause earth. Yes. In the midst of the water. In the midst of the water. And let it divide the water. And let it divide the water. From the water. From the waters. So the earth, which is the dust, gonna divide the water from the waters. Yes. And God made the firmament. And God made the firmament, which is the dust, which is the earth. Yes. And divided the water. And divided the water. Which were under the firmament. Which was under the firmament, which is the water, under the earth. Do you understand me? Yes. From the waters which were from the above. water that was from above. The firmament. The firmament. Yes. And it was so. It was so. And God called the firmament. And God called the firmament, which is the earth, which is the dust that He created. Heaven. Heaven, which is the kingdom of So all of you trying to go to heaven, but God created the heaven in the firmament in the dust and place you in heaven but you trying to go to read over from verse 1 in the beginning in the beginning God created the go very slow you hungry? more water? in the beginning God created the heaven and the earth hold on In the beginning, God created the heaven, heaven and the earth. And the earth. Continue. And the earth was. And the earth was without form. Without form. That means it was just water. There was no dust, no earth, no tree, no stones, just water. Yes. And void. It was void. Darkness. Was upon the deep. Yes. And darkness was upon the face of the deep. And darkness was upon the face of the deep. And the Spirit of 
God. But the Spirit of God, as according to the Bible, but I will say the mystery of God or the anointing of God. Continue. Move your tongue. Move like a mighty wave of glory upon the face of the waters. Of the waters. And God said. And God says. Let there be light. Let there be light. And there was light. And immediately there was light. And God saw the light. And God saw the light. That it was that good. That it was good. And God yes. divided the light. And God divided the light from the darkness. From the darkness. And God. Yes. Called the light day. And God called the light day. And the darkness. And the darkness. He called night. He called night. And the evening. And the evening and the morning were the first day. Were the first day. So the sun ruled the light in the day. The moon ruling light in the night. Am I clear? Let's go deeper. And God said, and God says, let there be, let there be a firmament, a firmament in, the midst in the midst of the water. If I want my yes. In the midst of the water. In the midst of the water. And let it divide. And let it divide the waters. The waters from the waters. From the waters. Yes. And God. And God made the firmament. Made the earth, which is the firmament, which is the dust. And divided the waters. And the earth and the dust divide the water. Which were under the firmament. Which was under the firmament. From the waters. From the waters. Which were above. Which was above. So there is water and earth and there is waters above. Continue. The firmament. Yes. And it was so. So the earth divide the water from the waters. Continue. And God called the firmament. And God called the earth the firmament. Heaven. Heaven. And the evening. And the evening. And the morning. And the morning. Were the second. Were the second day. day. So this is a firmament. This is the kingdom of God. This is the earth. And this is the heaven. That you want to go. So we are at the second day. Let us see what happened in the third day. And God said. And God says. Let the waters. Let the waters. Under the heaven. Under the heavens, which is this heaven. Be gathered together. Be gathered together. Unto one place. Unto one place. And they call it sea. Yes. And let the dry. Yes. They let the dry land. Appear. Appear. And it was so. And it was so. And God called. And God called. The dry land. The dry land. Earth. Earth. Continue. And the gathering together. And the earth and the ferment is the same heaven. Continue. And the gathering together. And the gathering together. Of the waters. Yes. Call he. Call he. Seas. And God saw. And God saw. That it was good. That it was good. Yes. And God said. And God says. Let the earth. Let the earth. Bring forth. Bring forth. Grass. Grass. The herbs. Herb. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the fruit yes. tree yielding fruit yes. after his kind. Continue. Whose seed is in itself My God. upon the earth, mm -hmm. and it was so. so. And the earth brought forth grass. And the earth brought forth grass. And herb. herbs yielding. Yes. Seed after Seeds. his kind. Continue. And the tree. And the trees. Fruit. Fruits. Whose seed mm. was in itself. Continue. After his kind. And God saw that and it God was good. saw it was good. It was good. Yes. And the evening. And the evening. And the morning. And the morning. Were the third day. Were the third day. Continue. 
let us see what happened in the fourth day. And God said, and God said let there be light. Let there be light again. But he said, well, let there be light in the first day. Yes. But this is the fourth day. He said, let there be light again. So there was no light. Continue. Let there be light in the firmament, in the firmament. of the heaven mm. to divide the yes. day from the night. But he did the day from the night before. Continue. And let them be for signs. And let them be for signs. And for seasons. And for seasons. And for days. And for days. And years. And years. And let them be for lights. The thought it happened before. In the in the firmament yes. of the heaven to give light upon the earth. Mm. And it was so. I don't understand. You confuse me. So in the fourth day, God is saying that he need light in the heavens and in the earth. But on the first day, it was saying that God said that there be light and there was light. So I don't get this. It confuses me. Is it that the, the fourth day should, should go back to the first day? Read over from verse 1. Just verse 1. In the beginning, yes. God created the heaven and the earth. And the earth. Yes. And the earth was without form. form. And void. And void. And, and darkness. darkness was, was upon the deep. The face of the deep. Yes. Hold on, hold on. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. So he created heaven and the earth. Find it done this on the first day. Continue now. And darkness was upon the heaven and darkness was upon the earth. Fine. So God said something right here. So too much darkness and can't see. So God said, let there be light. And the Spirit of the Lord moved upon the face of the water, and God said, Let there be light, and there was light. So, what type of light it was? That's the problem I have. Let us see what type of light it was. Read verse 4. And God saw the light, it was good, and God divided the light from the darkness. And God called the light day. And the night and the evening and the morning was the first day. He done this. Go back to verse 16. And God made two great lights. No, go back to verse 40. And God said, And God said, Let there be Let there be light again. In the ferment of, of the, the heavens, heavens to, to divide, divide the, the day from, from the, night. the night. But you do it already. <laughs> so what's the problem? Where did this writer come from? Go back to verse one. For maybe we're missing something. <laughs> Yes. God created the heaven, the heaven, and the earth. And the earth. Yes. So the heaven and the earth created. It don't know. Continue. And the earth was. And the earth was without, without form. Without form. And void. And void. And darkness. And darkness was upon the deep. So there was no light. There was no sun. There was no moon. There was no stars. You understand? Yes. And the Spirit of the Lord moved upon the face of the waters, verse 3. And the Lord said, let there be light. So the sun and the moon created. No, it appeared. Verse 4 said, and the Lord saw that the light was good. And God divided the light from the darkness. Verse 5 said, God called the light day and the darkness he called night and the evening 
and the morning was the first day. So it showed him saying, divide the light from the darkness. He put the moon to rule the night and the sun to rule the day. So it done this. Go back now to verse 14. And God said, and God said let, there be let there be light again. In the firmament. In the firmament. Of the heaven. Of the heaven. To divide. To divide. The day. The day. From, from the, the night. But him do it in verse 1. Yes. And let them be and for, for signs, for seasons, and, and for, for days, and for years. years. Continue. And let them be. And let them be for light. For light, but there's light already. Yeah. Let them be for light in the firmament of, of heaven. the heavens to give light upon the earth. And it was so. But all of this happened in verse 1. Continue. And God made. And God made two great, two great light. What him do it already? The greater light. No, sir. To rule the day. Cook ahead, people can't give me problem. <laughs> so he created a next two light. Yes. The greater light. The greater light. To rule the day. To rule the day. And the lesser, the lesser light. To rule the night. To rule night. He made, he made the, star the stars also. also. Continue. And God set them, and God set them in, the firmament in the firmament of the, heaven of the heavens to give light, to give light upon, the earth. upon the earth. The firmament on the earth is the same thing. Continue. And to rule is not like this. You have a house and you put the bulb them nicely. But they're the same house, isn't it? So it's the same thing. It's just because the, 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 the sky is the, the roof of the earth. So it's the same thing, yes. And to rule over the day. Yes. And over the night. Continue. And to divide the light. And to divide the light again. From the darkness. From the darkness. And God saw. And God saw. It was good. It was good. Continue. And the evening and the evening and the morning, and the morning were the fourth day. day. So he created light twice. Continue. And God said, and God says, Let the waters, let the waters bring forth, bring forth abundantly, abundantly the moving creature, the moving creatures that have life. Yes. And fall that may fly yes. above the earth. Mm. In the open firmament of heaven. The same thing like earth, the same thing. So the earth, the heaven, and the firmament is the same thing. It's like you have a house, as I tell you. The roof, you put the lights in the roof, but it's the same house. But they call it ceiling. Am I right? But is it is the house the same? Way? The water is maybe your pipe, your water tank, that you have the waters to flush the bathroom, to cook and do stuff. It's the same thing. Continue. And God creates waves. And God creates waves. Winds of life. Waves. And every living creature and that every moves. living creature that moves. Which the waters brought forth yes. abundantly. Continue. After their kind. My God. And every winged fowl. Yes. After his kind. Continue. And God saw. It was that good. It was good. Continue. And God blessed them. God blessed them. Say. Multiply. Be fruitful. Be fruitful. Multiply. multiply. What did God sense? Be fruitful. Be fruitful. And multiply. multiply. What did God sense? Be fruitful. Be fruitful. And, and multiply. multiply. What did God sense? Be fruitful and multiply. Can you abstain and multiply? Can you stay by yourself and multiply? Can you hide away and multiply? Continue. And fill the waters. And fill the waters in the seas. And let fall. Let fall. Multiply. Multiply. In the earth. In the earth. And the evening. The evening and the morning. And the morning. Fifteen. Yes. And God said, "It's good. Let the earth yes. bring forth yes, grass. the living creature 
creatures. After his kind. Creatures and all different stuff. And everything. Mm. Yes. And beasts of the earth. The beasts of the earth. After his kind. Yes. And it was so. Very good. And God made the beasts of the earth. Yes. After his kind. Continue. The cattle. And cattle after their kind. And everything that and creep everything upon the earth. That creepeth upon the earth after his kind. Yes. And God saw that it was, it was good. good. Very good. Yes. And God said, Let us make man in our image. So God was talking to somebody who wasn't alone. So he said, let the black man in our own image and our own likeness. After our likeness. Re no, repeat again. And God so said, God said, let make man in our own image and our own likeness. likeness. Repeat again. And, and God, God said, let, let make man in our own image and our own likeness. Repeat again. And God says, let make man in our own image and our own likeness. Did he say, let make woman? No. So woman was born in sin and shape in iniquity. But man was born in the image and likeness of God. Because the Bible only said, let make man in our own image and our own likeness. So where woman come from? It must be a sin, isn't it? So we want to find where women come from before we start to chase them and blast them because I'm going to a scripture that the Bible says a woman is not supposed to speak in the church. It is a shame and disgrace for a woman to speak in front of crowd, in front of people, in front of holy place. That means something bad about women that we need to speak about. Do you understand me today? Read over that verse. And God said, and God said let, let make, make man, man, let us, that means he's talking to somebody, but to me he's talking to himself. So God said unto himself, let us make man in our image and our likeness. Did he say something about woman? And he never speak to woman about that. No, Rasta. Continue. And God said, Let us make man in our image. Yes. After our likeness. After our likeness. And let them, let them have dominion. Have dominion over the fish of over the, the sea, fish of the sea. And over the fowl of the air. Of the air and over the cattle. Over the cattle. And over all the and earth. And over all the earth. And over every and over every creeping thing. Creeping things. That creep it. That creep it. Upon the earth. Read over that scripture. And God said, and God said let, us make let us make man in our image, our image and after our, our, likeness. our likeness. And let them have and let them have dominion. And let them have have. And let them have have dominion. That means rule, control. Continue. Dominion over the fish of the sea. Over all the fish of the sea. And over, over the fowl of the, the air. The fowl of the air. And over, over the cattle. The cattle. And over, over all the earth. All the earth. So who run the earth? Rasta. So what woman run? If you have a house with a idiot man, it must go down. If you have a house with a cocoa head man, it has to mash up. Matter of fact, you will also lose your house. Because the Bible said that no matter what type of man, he is in control. That means woman a idiot. Because if you make a cocoa head man run your house, your pass full. And if you obey the stipulation laws of this book, you put yourself in problem. You with me, somebody? So as a woman, I must tell you, 
Never let an idiot man run your house because of this word. Because it's a drunkard read this verse. Never let a drunkard, a smoker, someone who had no good run your house as a woman. Don't let that happen to you. Do you understand me? Very important in life that a woman be very conscious if you don't have a conscious man. This book were written by men that have PhD. Brain damage people. And that's why they make so much mistake in it. My words and gift to you today, live according to the climate that surround you. Live according to the power that flow around you. Live according to the knowledge that God puts inside of you. Because if you follow this book, you're always in problem. Always in problem. Who are we going to read some of the foolishness? Continue. And over every creeping thing yes. that creeps upon the earth. Continue. So God created man. Yes. In his own image. So God created man in his own image. Three, that from the foundation of the earth, man was made like God. I don't know what the woman then. We're going to have to find out something. So God yes. created man in his own image. And likeness. In the image of I God. I can't wait to find out what happened to woman. Created him. <laughs> Male and female. Rasta. Created him. Men. Woman did it too. Yes. <laughs> well, on, go over. So God created man. Yes. His own in His image. own image. In the image. In the image of God. Of God created. Created. He him. He him. Male. Male. And female. And female. Created. Created. He. He. So how them said, you're born in sin and shape in iniquity. See that? Woman also created in the image and likeness of God. So I realized that when he was writing this verse, he had come back. He had come back. I am happy, my sisters. Hug each other. I am happy you're a part of the race of God. I'm so happy for you. Because if you're never in at the beginning, you can't be in at the ending. So thank God he put you in the beginning. Matter of fact, the first chapter, woman is in. I'm so happy for you. I have to have a dream for you. I'm so happy for you. Happy Sunday. I'm happy. Because I was saying all along, we're going to have to separate. <laughs> but now realize that he created him male and female. What a lovely God. Let us hear what happened along the line. Let's just see if you can go back. Read for me. And God bless them. He bless us. I'm so blessed. From the beginning. Continue. And God said unto them. And God said, hold on. You talk to it? Go ahead. And so God said unto us, yes. And God blessed them. He blessed us, yes. And God said unto them. And God said unto us, be fruitful yes. and multiply. What did God say? Be fruitful, be fruitful and multiply. 
ay. Your pastor, leave read that verse. <laughs> what read over? What did God say? And God, Pull up. God bless male and female, and God speak for the first time to us. What did He say to us? You never said, "Boy, I'm going to eat and drink, go marry, go drink liquor, go have party, go go dance and go build houses." You never said no like that. The first that God said unto man, what is it? God bless you. First words that come out of the mouth of the divine, you must go do stop. Read over. God bless them. And no, read, go back to the next verse. So God created. So God created man, man in his own image. In his own image. And in the image. And in the image of God. Of God. Created. Created. He him. He him. Male. Male. And female. And female. Created. Created. He them. He them. And God bless us. He said, you are great, child. You are peculiar. You are royal. You are undefined. You are a precious child of a living God. Bless us. Yes. And God said unto, and God said unto us for the first time after he blessed us. He said, the first thing I want you to do upon the earth when you meet a woman, you know, by myself. No one said, as a man, we talk about the man. He said, man, the first thing you do when you meet a woman, you must multiply. Give her a woolly picnic. Give her a woolly for children. Give I know. You talk about what the God said to the woman. You talk. Be fruitful and active. What is fruitful? children. Lord of mercy. Read. And God listen. And God says, Yes. Yes. Fruitful. Be fruitful. Multiply. And Replenish the earth. That means fill it up. Yes. Subdue it. And subdue it. Control it. So who is in control? We. Man and woman. Before he said he gave them control. That means woman have control and man have control. Don't tell me about no, no man is the head of the house. So what happened to the woman? She not head. Hold on. You not done anything? I mean, I preach to them. I teach me. Read. And and replenish the earth. Yes. And subdue it. Subdue it. And have dominion. Yes. Over the fish of the sea. Yes. And That. And God said, Yes. Behold, Behold, I have given you I have given you every herb, every herb bearing seed, bearing seeds, which is yes. upon, upon the, the earth. face of all the earth. Continue. And every tree mm. in the which is the fruit of a tree. Oh, very nice. Yielding seed. Yes. To you. To you. It shall be for meat. Do you hear that? That means it give you food for meat. That means you food to eat. Continue. And to every beast of the and earth. Every beast you must eat anything. Poor, cow, donkey, cow, moat, food, joe, tree, everything. 
lizard, snake, frog, everything. But you're not going to eat frog. You give it a chance, then move. But he said everything. everything. Continue. And I am working with the first. Creation part. He will say everything. Continue. And to every beast of the earth. Every beast of the earth. And to every fowl of every the fowl air. Every fowl of the air. And to everything that creepeth. Everything that creepeth. Upon the earth. Upon the earth. Wherein, wherein is life. There is life. You must I control it. Given I have given every green every herb. Green herb. For for meat to you. And it was so. And it was so. And God saw. And God saw. Everything. Everything. That he had made. That he had made. And behold. And behold. It was very good. Very good this time. What? Very, very good. good. Continue. And the evening. And the evening. The morning. And the morning. Were the sixth day. Were the sixth day. The evening and the morning were the sixth day. I'm working with something. Continue. Thus, the heavens and the earth yes. were finished. So the heaven and the earth finished. Everything done. And God tell you what we do. And we are going to do it as from tonight. And, and all the posts. So who no one like it? We are going to read the scripture to you. God said, if you do it. Continue. Thus the heavens yes. and the earth were finished. So the heavens and the earth finished. God commands us to do whatever we have to do, and we have to do what we have to do. And all the hosts of yes. them. Continue. And on the seventh day. And the seventh day. God ended. He his work, ended his work. Which he had made. Which he had made. And he rested. And he rested. On the seventh day. And the seventh day. From all. From his all his work which he had made which he had made and god blessed and god blessed the same day and, and sanctified it, it because, because it was that in it, he in rest from all his work which he have created upon the earth salam Continue verse 4. These are the generations. Now we're going to hear about the first generations of the heavens. Read now. These are the generations. These are the generations of the earth when they were created in the day that the Lord God made the heaven and the earth. Let me hear this story. These are the generations of yes. the heavens and of the earth. This chapter 2 we are now. I hope you're following me. When they were created mm -hmm. in the day that the Lord God creates God made the he earth and the heavens. Yes. And every plant of the field yes. before it was in the earth. Mm -hmm. And every herb of the field yes. before it grew. Yes. For the Lord God had not caused it to rain upon the earth. That's the, that's the problem we have for the people. He divide the water from the waters in verse 1. No, he's saying that he don't cause it to rain upon the earth yet. So where water comes from? Why is he on distracting the prophet of God? Verse 1 says he divide water from the waters. Created the earth, the heaven, the sun, the moon, he done with all of that. Now this verse chapter 2 is telling us now that he have never called it to rain upon the earth. So where the water come from in verse 1? Jesus. He's learned as men, man. At chapter 2. Go back to chapter 1. Read over. Let me see if I will make a mistake. 
in the beginning. In the beginning. Yes. God created the heaven, the heaven, and the earth. And the earth. Yes. And the earth. Yes. Was without form. And void. And void. And water. And darkness. And darkness. Was upon, upon the deep. The face of the deep. Yes. And the spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters. So the water was there all along. It was there all along. So how now chapter 2 is telling us that God have never caused it to rain? Them thing may get they making too much mistakes in the, the, the first chapter. So how you get tired so quick and you start reading? Uh, all right. Let us say when they are drinking, so forget about it. Go back to chapter two. Go back to generations and read from verse five. So let us say he make a mistake. He was drinking. And his, his girlfriend was giving him problem. He might get born at the Easter, and him they look at go through the look at storm. And when you go to look at storm, and you go through your your your, your thing, you make look a mistake. So let us see if mom make a next mistake again. Yes. And every plant of the field yes. before it was in the earth. Yes. And every herb of the field before it grew. Yes. For the Lord God had not have not caused it, caused to, it rain to rain upon, upon the earth. earth. This is a mistake. But in God. And there was not a man. And there was no man. But God make man already. <laughs> Let me see if I make a mistake. He made man in his own image, male and female. Now chapter 2 is saying there was no man to till the ground. To till the ground. So when did the ground is a healer? No, sir. So you never sell it up Read. But there went up a mist from the earth, from the earth, and water, and stored the water, the whole face, the whole face of, the ground. of the ground. And the Lord God, and the Lord God formed man, formed man of the dust, no, sir. of the ground. So then the man they run this up when he found before where did him come from? Something around when he said just stop something right with some man. And and you say he make a mistake in Genesis and you go where on do to make when it's mistake. He make, he make mistake same place. Over and over and over again. The God just make man and female in verse one. Bless them to let them multiply, have children, if you and no one have to pick me, run him out of your house. And all of these stuff that God tell him. And now chapter 2 is telling to me that God now has no man for the earth. So, uh, something wrong with me. So it's very hard for a prophet of God to teach you the Bible. It's like you're drinking a drink that don't strain good. And every time you put in the mouth, you, you, you taste green. It's uncomfortable for me. As a bishop and a pastor, I'm running through a slide because I'm just read, read and just give. But everything I read, I have to see through what I'm reading. So this cannot be explained by me. It's scamming, it's corrupt, it's abused towards my intelligence. But let us read the garbage. And the Lord God yes. formed man. God formed man again. Of the dust of the of the dust. And breathe into and his breathe nostrils, into his nostril the breath of life. The breath of life. And man become a living soul. So the one name when he make run his soul, what did he become? No, sir. 
continue. And the Lord God yes. planted a garden. Planted a garden. Eastward. Eastward. In Eden. In Eden. And there. And there. He put the man. He put the man. Whom he had formed. And out of the ground, out of the ground may, the Lord may the Lord God, God to, grow to grow every tree yes. that is pleasant to the sight yes. and good for food. Yes. The tree of life yes. also in the midst of the garden. Continue. And the tree of knowledge of good and evil. Yes. And a river went And out. a river of Eden went out of Eden. We understand that that you put in, in the womb of a woman, the water bursts and you come out. We teach that already, right? So you understand that, yes. To water the garden. Yes. And from thence, and from thence it was parted. The woman started to have many children in twins, in uh, triplets. You have four, three years. We understand that. We teach and that already. It came into four heads. Four heads, four children, yes. The name of the first the is. The name of the first is. Son. Yes. That is it which compasses yes. the whole land of Havilah. Continue. Where there is gold. Yes. And the gold of that land is good. Yes. There is the Delio yes. and the ox stone. Yes. And the name of the second river the name is of the second river is Kihon. Yes. The same is it that compassed the whole land of Ethiopia. Yes. And the name of the third river is Hidekel. Hidekel. Yes. That is it which goes towards. You see, you see the name that they give the children. Please stop. Give your picture the name Roy, <laughs> Tamara. Give them some name where people can't spell, so they can't book make other man spell it for them. Get the girl. So when they bring you picking them name to other man, other man say, come to my place, we can't spell the name there. Give them some long, funny name that them can't even spell or understand. Give the name of, of this one. Kitty Kel. That is it. Yes. Which go toward the east of Assyria. Yes. And the fourth river is Euphrates. Euphrates. And the Lord God took the man. Yes. And put him in the tooth. Mm -hmm. To dress it. To dress it. To dress it. Keep it. Keep it. And the Lord God commanded the man saying. Yes. Of every tree of the garden. No base eat freely. Everything on the garden, eat, drink, marry yourself. But of the tree of the knowledge. But of the tree of the knowledge where, where children have to come from, fruits have to grow. No, eat have a picnic them. And evil. Yes. Thou shalt not eat of it. No, eat this up. For evil. Eat picnic them, I'm going to last. And then that's what I'm saying. Most of you should have five children, no, you end up with two. Check them gone. Put them gone. God, he knows. For in the day yes. that thou eatest thereof, thou shalt surely die. That means it's not yoga, did you know? And he picked me them back all day. So, Angie, I should born. From your 21 year old, your first boyfriend hit up Anja. So Anja never back. Tamara should born when you're 25, you eat half Tamara again. You end up with two big new, you should have four. At 30, you should have four, you only have two. Be careful. Continue. Of the tree of the knowledge of good yes. and evil, thou shalt not eat of it. No, not eat there. For in the day that thou eatest thereof, thou shalt surely die. Pick them off. And yes. the Lord God said, yes. Is it 
not good, not that good. the man should be alone. It's not good. I will make him and help me for but him. But God already make him one run of this already. Anyway, make him, that means God is giving him more. 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 And yes. out of the ground, yes. the Lord God formed every beast of the field and every fowl of the air. Hold on. God just said it is not good for a man to be alone. So God going to make the man a help meet for him. That's what the Bible said. So where animal come from? <laughs> Make woman fear man now. So where, where animal just come appear so far? Where bees appear at the same time. But go ahead. And out of the ground, the Lord God formed every beast of the field. But he make them already in chapter one. This man keep on repeating himself over and over again. Jesus, continue. And every fowl of the air, and brought them unto Adam to see what he would call them. Yes. And whatsoever Adam called every living creature, mm. that was the name thereof. Mm. And Adam gave names to all cattle, and to the fowl of the air. Yes. And to every beast of the field. Continue. But for Adam, there was not found and help meat for him. Uh, so the female that he made in chapter one was a mystery. Let us make it flow. Continue. And the Lord God yes. caused a deep sleep upon to Adam. fall upon Adam. Yes. And he slept. And he took one of his ribs yes. and clothed of the flesh instead thereof. And the rib which the Lord God had taken from man made he a woman mm. and brought her unto the man. Yes. And Adam said, This is now bone of my bone. Flesh of my and flesh. Flesh of my flesh. Royal family. She shall be called woman. woman. Yes, hold on. Problem will come. Read. Because she was taken out of man. Yes. Therefore. Therefore. Shall a man. For this cause. Shall a man live? His father. His father, yard, father house, mama house, daddy house, caregiver house. Continue. Therefore shall a man leave his father and his mother, mm -hmm. and shall cleave, and unto, shall his cleave unto his wife, and they shall be, and one, they flesh. Shall be one in one flesh. flesh. And they were both naked, the and the man and the woman, and they shall not be ashamed. You hear that? I repeat, for this cause, you must leave your mother and your father and cling to someone who you married to or who you love, and you shall become one in one flesh. And for you to become one in one flesh, you have to be naked into a dark room. One in one flesh mean a marriage, a union, a commitment, a covenant with God. That means you have a child with the person, and half of you is in the person, and half of the child, half of the, the person is in the child. So half of you is in the child, and half of the man is in the child. So both of you become one in one flesh in the child. That is the marriage of God. And you will not be ashamed. Should we go over 
chapter 2, verse, but chapter 3, uh, we should just leave it alone. Should we go to chapter 3? Yes, go to chapter 3. Let me see if no more mistake made. No, the serpent was more subtle yes. than any beast of the field which the Lord God had made. Yes. And he said unto the woman, Yes. Yea, hath God said, Ye shall not eat of every tree yes. of the garden. And the woman said unto the serpent, We may eat of the fruit of the trees of the garden. Stop right there. Close the Bible. Don't give me no headache to you. take life and place it into a book called the Holy Bible. And if the Bible don't say it, you don't want to do it. Am I right? And that's why we live in short. I preached a sermon a couple weeks ago. And once God says something, you must come to pass. So no matter how, I, I like this juice, which is, it is Welch. Thank you, Welch. But no matter how I love it, I like it. After an hour or two, I have to go to the bathroom and have to pass on one tenth of this. Else after a while, bacteria, sickness start to take you. And if you continue to eat and drink, it start to continue to take you more. It's just life. You cannot pray to stop nature. You cannot intercede to stop nature. You cannot go and fasting to stop nature. Once God signal you, you have to do what the signal says. And because of all of this, Christian people have to hide and do things where you could do things face to face. Most of you today, as I'm telling you, you have to hide to do things just for your pastor. You no know, cause shame to be an and if you even do things and problem take you, which is not problem, but to get pregnant, you can't go back to church. If you go back to church, either they put your back bends or they read you out of church. And to the pastors, prophets, apostles, elders that lead God people straight. Lack of knowledge is wicked. What did I say? Lack of knowledge is wicked. It's like you have a car and you don't understand how to turn on the AC, you turn on the heater. And you burn up in your car. Today we won't be long because we have our events going on over here, so please soon pack up. So we just want to pray for you. We want to usher you in the presence of God. Rush your home so you can go home, turn on your TV, and watch the clips that are going up this afternoon. We have some videos that will go up tonight. May you enjoy watching them. May you take part of his glory. May you understand that you're not alone. It's not over yet. Your life is just begun. Your greatness is just begun. 
some of you, your greatness just taught people to you. Because where you are, the greatness could not move because of your surrounding. You can see brighter now, you can see clearer now, you can see the light, so you can shine very bright. And that's why we're here to tell you, your God asset, your God extinguished value, and you're going very far in society. Just have the right attitude and you reach the ultimate level. But also, they always said, if you want to reach the ultimate level, you have to have the ultimate attitude. You have the ultimate attitude and you reach the ultimate level. Stay focused, stay positive, stay righteous, stay holy, eat good, sleep good, enjoy life, and let God be for you in this time.
are building a church in Man Manchester. One of the most luxurious church that we'll ever see in the Caribbean. I'm not building it because of the benefit of traffic group. I'm building it because of the benefit of God people. I support everyone who wants to have a good life. I want to contribute to the well-being of society and the development of the life and people of God. So this is what we do. We are putting our H2B program together. It is 100% approved as yet. Our directors are putting the documents together as quickly as possible so she can qualify for the rules and stipulations of the laws of the land. You must be very warned that scammers around there putting up my picture on Facebook saying that I am on Facebook collecting 5000 of a registration fee. I only do my thing face to face. I will not call you to go to the bank to put in no money in the bank for no registration fee. Because registration fee don't collect by no organization who are doing overseas program. You have to go to the Ministry of Labor and pay your fee to do whatever they do. So it could never be us. So all of those persons who get call or who get texts or whatever they do online, only thing I have online is close. <laughs> Families, your friends, your neighbors, we only do things face to face. Not us. So please don't follow these cameras and send money or give them because you see me picture on the system. They manipulate my picture and put it up there and make it look like a me. Do not follow these people. We, if we're going to send you on program, I send you go work because you have certain conditions in your life. I will purchase a ticket for you. I'll find accommodation for you. And we give you a traveling money. So we will not collect money for you for that. Am I right? doing a lot for our society. So people will come against us. People will come to interview us. People will come to investigate us. You find all different type of persons come around, spying you all different type of thing. Ministry International cannot go down and will not go down. We are not untouchable. I repeat, we are not untouchable. We are unbeaten. So we're not saying so you can't touch us. What will happen after it? Power of God means international do not negotiate with terrorists. Every ant that crawl through every door is a member of my church. Every fly, every insect, every bat, every lizard, every animal, anything that life that crawl upon the earth, commanded by certain power. Amen. 
So all of them, if they want to sleep in the bed at night in peace, mind their own business. And let the work of God go on. So God keeps the cross. The Bible said the day King Uzziah died, the power of God reigned through the reigns. And the people of God start to survive. You have some people, they're stagnant in your life. You can't flow. I remember we get 40 visa one December from Manuel people. 40 visa. And we send the 40 at them same time. We emptied church over 50 times on pocket back. So we're not looking at pop church. We you come here and stagnant and sit down. This is a church in the flow. We church you. We put you together. We let your life get ready for a better tomorrow. <laughs> Pastor Chin can tell you, those 336 passports, is the sugar money do it? All of those passports that we take out for people who do not have a passport. Almost put yourself in problem because then call a pastor to now a big office. I investigate how she taking out too much passport for people. Whenever some scam in Shagram. Just to make you qualify for a better tomorrow. We put our life at risk. We may care help all at the same time. But we're doing the best we can. We give away over 500 cell phones. We're still giving going up to 600 cell phones for all the persons them who do not have a cell phone or who really have a little old banger. Your little sugar caused that to happen. So all of them who crucify us that we are sell sugar, they don't know what we do. That's the problem. The government forced you to pay tax on your property to take the money to help the society. Isn't that the government money? Is your money he take to help the society? So when you buy a bag of sugar, I take it to help you to buy a phone, help you stock a little shop, open a little business, pay tuition. You know how much hundreds of people have children who are not going to school that profit you sent to school. So they crucify us because they do not know what we do. I could not work to take care of so much people. We have to find a solution for the problem and fix it. So while you bless, someone else is getting blessed. It just is like that. We don't have to prove to people what we do. We only know what we do already. You see it live. You watch it live, and you're here to see it for yourself. Yes. So we don't have to prove them to no one. But people will always talk. But well, guess what? We're going very high. Your shop could be the next one that we're going to stock. Your bar will be the next one we're going to stock. 
Your daughter or your son, Parishan, will be the next one we're going to pay for. Your house loan or your car loan could be the next one we're going to pay for. Your phone will be the next one we're going to replace. Don't watch the destruction. Watch the progress. Watch the progress. For you, as Power of God Ministry International Event, you shall cross. 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 Seven, seven seat of van coming. So if them think woman can run taxi. And when you lend, when you borrow, we give. All of those 27 vehicles, we're going to give our members one by one. Said, so I am blessed and highly favored. I am great. I am wonderful. I am awesome through the eye of Tayo.